Tyson Fury's legs might have gone. Shit. Just, just a response from Good Augusta. God Almighty. Listen, what they don't understand. You know what I'm amazed at? How little these so called boxing experts actually know about the job. Pro boxing fans here in Brighton, uh, John, we've just seen your son, Roman, put in a very convincing performance. Um, just give me your thoughts. We've seen him progress nicely. Uh, I know it's just still four rounders, but just talk to me about how you're satisfied with his progression so far. Well, I'm very satisfied and uh, under the guidance of Bob Howard, you know, he's doing really well, isn't he? Because Bob keeps him grounded, he keeps him focused and he works hard with him tirelessly because I've been away in Saudi with Tyson and before that I was away in camp with Tommy with Bob but Bob has never rested, so give Bob our credit. He has not come up for air. I've had a rest, I've been home, I've had a sleep. This man had Roman back in the gym the very next day. Come in, Bob. Come in, I just want to introduce this guy to the rest of the world here. Thank you. This man is probably as good a trainer as what's out there. You know why? His consistency is unleveled in this game. And believe me, he does a good job too, as you can see. That's a rank stone novice who's never boxed before in his life. No, no amateur contest, nothing. Two years ago, he's 20 stone, depressed. Look where he is now. And just ended a good night here in Brighton with a knockout. Bob, uh, to this man here. Yeah, just give us, uh, give us a few thoughts on uh, Roman's performance tonight. I thought it was very, uh, very, very good tonight. He's, he's, he's just uh, wants to learn all the time. He's always busy in the gym. You know, he's, he's, he's there every, every day, early. Turns up, wants to learn, just graphs really hard. So he's only a novice, isn't he? Since his third ever fight, so what can you expect? But he, he put up a fantastic performance tonight to get rid of a, a tough man. And he wanted to fight the kid. The yeah, kid come to him for a fight. fight. He took a lot of stick in the first two rounds and he was still there pitching, wasn't he? He was gritting his teeth and coming forward, winging the big shots. And no one's done that to him. You've had kids with, well, God knows how many amateur contests and amateur championships turning, probably not done that to him. You know, give Brad his due. Good game kid. And you know something? I've never seen a ginger haired kid without bottle. You know, every one of them is the same. When I see ginger hair, I see fire. You know what I'm saying? And that's what he brought. So fair play to Brad. You know, boxing needs people like him. He come to fight, but he took a good shot. And Roman can bang. I know that for having him on the pads and the sparring, haven't we? Because yeah. he's knocked a couple out and sparring, hasn't he? With headgear on 18 ounce gloves. So, onwards and upwards. We can't go wrong. And we've ended the, uh, the night on a high. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to quickly just. Uh, Ask one, more, two more questions. There's this whole thing on social media that you've been calling out, KSI. You want your money, John? Of course, I want uh, your money. Just talk to me. me. What was? Have you had any conversation? Is there anything well, going no, on in regards you know to that? What, at the end of the day, I've made two bets now and never been paid. And if I lost the bet, I'd be paying. You know. But at the end of the day, all I want to do is donate it to a good cause. If you don't want to lose your money, keep your mouth shut. And I'm a travelling man. In our culture of people, if you bet and you don't pay, it's a death sentence. You get kicked up and down like a football and called every name under the sun. So if he wants to be respected by people like me and others out there, pay your money. But if you haven't got 200 grand, make a statement, say I haven't got it, and I'll go to the people behind him who has got the money in their brains. Because it's definitely not him. Because at the end of the day, he's made a bet, he honours it. And I don't want the money for myself because I'm not interested in money. It's no good to me. So what I'm going to do when he pays it, not if, when, I'm going to donate the lot to... Manchester Christie's Cancer Research in public so he knows I've not had one dime for myself because I'm not like that and I'll do it publicly and you know what it says in the Bible never do nothing publicly but I'll have to do this publicly because people think I've done it and put it in my pocket John Fury ain't like that and if I want money I'll go to my sons who's millionaires so I don't need his change but let's just see where his knackers are at paying a poxy little bet pay you bum Final one, John, sorry, before I let you go. Um, I don't want to talk a lot about Tyson because I know, obviously, yeah. the team doesn't want to talk a lot about Tyson, nah. but a lot of people have talked about Tyson a yeah, lot. Yeah, after... shit. Uh, one I wanted to talk about, I was listening to talk sport yesterday, Johnny Nelson Forget came that. on and Forget he said... They're eaters. But he sorry. said Tyson Fury's legs might have gone. Shit. Just, just a response from Good God, God Almighty. Listen, what they don't understand... You know what I'm amazed at? How little these so-called boxing experts actually know about the job. Ngannou was built like a tree. 19 stone, four or five of solid muscle, and the kid could fight. It's not how bad they want to look at Tyson. Tyson was okay. It's how good the other kid was as well. Giving Garnu credit, he brought his action, and he's a man mountain. Tyson's a boxer. That kid's been kicked in the face, nutted in the face, elbowed in the face. He's not going to bother about a boxing glove, is he? And Garnu was as tough as teak, big strong man. I think Tyson done very well, but the game plan could have been better. A lot of things could have been better. You know, but I know my son. 
it can get, he can get it right next time, can't he? But he got the win. He got the win, and that's what it's about. Winning. John, thank you very much. I know it's late. Thank you so much for giving thank us you your time much, once buddy. again. I appreciate your time. All thank best, you, buddy. Man. Thank you.